In this demonstration, we'll calculate the link budget required when antennas connected to two buildings are 600 feet apart. Let's start with our known values. On the left, we have our transmitting radio with the transmit power set at 20 dBm. We have a 7 dBi antenna with a cable connector loss of 1 dB. So on the transmit side, our EIRP is 26 dBm. On the receive side, we have a 7 dBi antenna with a cable connector loss of 1 dB. So we have a 6 dB gain on the receive side. So here we have one of many online free space path loss calculators. The antennas are 600 feet apart, so let's enter that first. I'm using channel 36, so I'll enter 5.180 for the frequency. I've already included the transmit and receiver gain, so I'll enter a zero for both in this calculator. Click Calculate and we can see the free space path loss is 91.97 dB. Let's round that to 92 dB. We can now calculate our receiver signal. We can take the transmit ERP of 26 dBm plus the receive 6 dB minus the 92 dB free space path loss, and our receive signal is a negative 60 dBm. To achieve the customer's required design rates, the receiver sensitivity needs to be negative 72 dBm. Is the link possible? Our fade margin is 12 dB, which is greater than our 10 dB requirement. So yes, this link is possible. Now what could we do if the minimum 10 dB fade margin requirement was not met here? Increasing the transmit power of the AP might work, but we also want to check and see if a higher gain antenna could be added to this design. 